our syllabus is 4 by 1 marks. So what I will do, I will take 2 by 1 multiplexer and design a circuit like this. You can see here, I will use 2 by 1 multiplexer 3 times. I will use 2 by 1 multiplexer 3 times. Okay. Because 1 2 by 1 multiplexer I have executed. Then I will execute the 4 by 1 multiplexer. Okay. So now I am going to open a new file which is 4 by 1 multiplexer very log module max 4 by 1 max 4 by 1 already just yesterday only I have executed this this is 2 by 1 completed now I am going to write in structural model 4 by 1 structural model So what I have done, you see here, I called this I called this 2 by 1 multiplexer 3 times. I called the 2 by 1 multiplexer 3 times. Okay. So see the diagram. See the diagram. This is first 2 by 1, second 2 by 1, third time 2 by 1. Three times I will call. So first 2 by 1, inputs are I0, I1, selection line is S0. Okay. Second 2 by 1, I2, I3 are the input, selection line again S0 only. Now third 2 by 1, the previous two 2 by 1 outputs will be inputs now and S1 is the selection line. Final output is F. Okay. So what I am doing, final output, yes I am taking. Overall you can see 4 by 1 multiplexer will have 4 inputs, I0, I1, I2, I3 and 1 output F. Selection lines are S0, S1. Okay. So now here I0, I1, I2, I3, these are inputs and S0, S1 are selection lines. F is output. Okay. Now intermediate, intermediate output, the first 2 by 1 marks output I am taking F0, uh, temporary name and the second 2 by 1 marks output I am taking temporary name F1. Okay. So F0, F1, I am declaring as YS. And now in the 2 by 1 multiplexer, in the 2 by 1 multiplexer, what is the order you have given? Two inputs, one selection line, and then only output. Okay. So two inputs, one selection line, and output. So similarly, we have to provide here two inputs followed by selection line, then output. So two inputs followed by selection line, then output. Two inputs followed by selection line, then output. Okay. So here I am considering S1 as the MSB bit. In the diagram, here I am giving MSB S1. Here I am giving uh, S0. Okay, S0 here I am giving. So now we will try for the execution. So we have to make this 4 by 1 multiplexer as top module. Check syntax. And now I will create a test bench for 4 by 1 max. New source, test picture, and then max 4 by 1 underscore TB. Now this is the test bench. Already the values have come. And the delay, I will take 20. So if you see the truth table of 4 by 1 multiplexer, see the truth table of 4 by 1 multiplexer. I will take the truth table here. Yes. If 0, 0, selection line 0, 0, I naught is the output. Selection line 0, 1, I1 is the output. 1, 0 means I2 is the output. 1, 1 means I3 is the output. Okay. So now I have to check this in with the help of test bench. So what I will do.
if i am putting selection line 0 0 whatever i not value is there that will appear on the output if i put selection line 0 1 selection line 0 1 whatever value on i1 i am giving that will come at the output if i am putting selection line 1 0 if i am putting selection line 1 0 then i2 value will come at the output whatever i maintain on i2 that will come as the output if I put 1, 1 on the selection line, 1, 1 on the selection line, whatever I3 I maintain, that will come as the output. Okay. So, to have one more check, I will paste this one more time. Other than I2, okay. Other than... I will put only I2 as 0, only I2 as 0 and then remaining 3 values, input side remaining 3 values, I will maintain as 1. What happens? Let me see. Okay. So, here also, I will maintain I3 value as 1, I3 value uh, 0, I3 value 0. Remaining values, all the three inputs, I will maintain one. This is just to check whether I3 only is carried out to the output. Okay. So, these are the combinations I am trying. Just I am making sure um, only that particular input appears at the output. Okay. So, now I have to select the test bench and simulate the 4 by 1 multiplexer test bench. So, you can see here, whenever selection line 0, 0, whenever selection line 0, 0, I0 and output are same. 0, 0 selection line, I0 and output are same. Next, 0, 1 selection line 0, 1, I1 value and output are same, I1 value and output are same. Okay. So, selection line uh, 1, 0, selection line 1, 0, I2 value and output are same. Selection line 1, 0 means I2 value 0, output also 0. Selection line um, 1, 0 means I2 value, output are same. Okay. And then three times I have checked that uh, because whatever you vary on the other input lines, it will not affect the output to show that. 1, 1 means I3 value will come at the output. You see I3 0. All inputs are 0, but only I3 value is carried to F. Okay. So here you can check it clearly. I3 value 0, all other inputs are 1, 1. Uh, but I3 value only carried out to the output. Last combination, I3 value 1, other inputs are 0. I3 value only comes at the output when selection lines are 1, 1. Okay. So, this is about 4 by 1 multiplexer um, in switch level modeling because we are invoking the 2 by 1 multiplexer which is written in switch level modeling. Okay. So, with this, uh, we have completed the 4 by 1 multiplexer switch level modeling. Only this one I have completed. 4 by 1 multiplexer switch level modeling I have completed. Okay. Just I will check how much time is left. <laughs> 